So bees are important for apple pollination because apples need bees to move the pollen for them in order to produce seeds that then make fruit that we eat. So if we didn't have bees, we would get lopsided apples. They're usually missing seeds, and so bees are essential for getting the shape of the fruit and the size of the apple that we like to see in the store and like to eat. So bees in an apple orchard are visiting flowers that are in bloom and they're moving pollen from apples that are unrelated to each other. So apple trees can't self-pollinate. They can't use the pollen from the same tree. They need pollen from another apple tree or from a crab apple. So in a lot of orchards, you'll see crab apple trees interplanted with, with the apple trees because they need that different pollen to be able to produce an apple. In addition to honeybees, there are a whole lot of wild pollinators. About 30 to 50 different species of wild pollinators are, will be present during bloom in apples. And a lot of them are nesting right in the orchards or they'll be in the orchard margins. Most apple growers make a contract with beekeepers who bring hives into their orchards during bloom. And those bees may have come from uh, California almonds before they come to apples for pollination or cherries or other earlier blooming crops, but they're renting those hives to supplement the pollination of wild bees that, might, that are all, also present in their orchards. There has been uh, a lot of news about honeybee shortages and the situation with honeybees is really complicated and there isn't a simple one reason answer for why there are shortages, but most apple growers, what has happened for them is that the pollination services that they're renting in the spring have doubled since about 2005, so now the cost of renting individual hives is, has increased. They haven't lacked bees. They've been able to get enough bees by the time they need them here in Michigan. We have enough hives to rent for apple pollination. Without bees and other pollinators, we wouldn't have the fruits and vegetables, especially apples, that Michigan is known for. And so it's vitally important to protect pollinators as a natural resource. <laughs>